Hi, I'm Dr. Jim Stepani, and welcome to my YouTube channel. I'll be covering topics like training, nutrition, and supplementation, as well as anything else my subscribers want to know. If you find this information helpful, don't forget to like, comment below, and share. And don't forget to subscribe so that you can be notified when I post new videos. Harvard researchers concluded that most people are deficient in several vitamins and minerals in a brand new study published in the highly respected medical journal, The Lancet. The researchers estimated that almost 70% of the world's population, or around 5 billion people, are deficient in vitamin E, iodine, iron, and calcium, and that almost 60% of the people, or around 4 billion people, are deficient in vitamin C and the B vitamins, folate or folic acid, and riboflavin. When broken up by gender, the researchers reported that men had a higher incidence of being deficient in magnesium, zinc, vitamins A, vitamin C, vitamin B6, and the B vitamins, thiamine and niacin. While women were more likely to be deficient in selenium, iron, iodine, calcium, vitamin B12, and the B vitamins, folate or folic acid, and riboflavin. These data show that it's difficult for anyone in any country to eat enough whole foods every day to get adequate amounts of all the essential micronutrients our bodies need unless we're eating a surplus of calories. What's even more problematic is the fact that this study represents the general population's micronutrient needs. Yet athletes and anyone who regularly trains intensely have even higher micronutrient requirements due to their higher energy metabolism and the demands of intense exercise. If you're deficient in any of these vitamins and minerals, it can negatively impact your health and performance, be it in the gym, on the field or court, and in the bedroom, not to mention the limited results you can expect to get from your workouts. In fact, having micronutrient deficiencies can increase your risk for cancer, diabetes, and heart disease. So if you think you don't need a multivitamin supplement because you think that you're getting adequate amounts of all the essential vitamins and minerals in your diet, you might want to consider this study and think again. In fact, other studies show that bodybuilders are often deficient in numerous micronutrients and that many popular diets don't provide adequate vitamin and mineral intake. This is particularly problematic when individuals are dieting to lose weight or body fat. So after looking at this study, you may want to consider taking a multivitamin supplement to cover your bases and ensure that your health and your performance are optimal.